Hello everybody, today I'm going to share with you this really interesting rotary lamp dimmer by Touch and Glow. Now this one is actually quite old. If you look at the date on it, it's from 2006 or 2004, but I think 2006. And on the back of the packaging, well, it says 2002 here, so anyway, it's definitely older than um, made currently. I got this at uh, my local Menards, and uh, these... Uh, Menards that I am local to, uh, they always have things that they find, and it's old, and they sell it anyway. Um, but whatever, sometimes you find some really cool things like this for a really decent price. I picked this up because I left my other dimmer that I use for videos down at college, and this one's really interesting because it doesn't have a 150 watt limit on it. This one is, has a 300 watt incandescent limit, so a lot more power can be used through this one than the other one that I was currently using. So we'll take a look at this thing. It's very neat. Definitely a lot bigger than the other one that you may have seen in some of my other videos. Large capacity 300 watt. Shows you how it goes in there. Again, quite an old thing. I wonder if that website still works. Who knows? <coughs> Excuse me. So let's go ahead and uh, looks like the only way to get into this is just punch a hole in it. That's not happening. <coughs> Excuse me. So that came off. Good for it. And here we have the adapter itself. Looks like there's even an off switch. Hey, that's pretty neat. Oh, weird, it clicks. The other one was just total rotary, where you could put it at any setting you wanted. This one clicks. Interesting. So here's some information, warning information, and I'm assuming, I'm not really gonna read it. Again, from 2004 or 2006, April 2006 is my guess. Really nice brass base on it though. Seems to be of pretty decent quality. So there's that and let me grab, because it says it can handle it, a 300 watt bulb. So make sure that's off. And that's how it would look in your socket. And then you put in your gigantic bulb because I don't know why you'd need this in your lamp. Unless you really need a lot of light. Just can't see? We'll get this big bulb. That'll fix it all. Anyway. Oh yeah, it's off. Sorry about that. Okay. That hums. So I'm just clicking it. And even at max, it still makes the humming noise. I do think it's nice that it has the off feature, though. That's pretty nice. So that's as dim as a 300 watt bulb can get on this thing. But very neat. This bulb was just in use, that's why it's all dirty. Sure. So anyway, there is the, I think it was Touch and Glow. Now the package is over there, so oh well with that. Touch and Glow rotary dimmer for your lamp socket. That's pretty much what it is. It is weird that you have to turn it and it clicks. Now the other ones that support lower wattages don't click like that. But very cool. Anyway, I really hope you enjoyed this video about this really interesting device. And also please comment, rate, and subscribe, and thank you very much for watching.